This is Tilda watching The Lion King. Good morning and Happy New Year, by the way. Are you enjoying this, Kitty? Good morning, happy new year. New year, new me, as you can tell. I'm all right. God, I'm a beaut. Hmm? Watching Lion King with a cat. So cute. She's like, Also, because she's slightly stupid as well. Right, um, so I'm going to do my post today, even though it is bank holiday today. But I've got like all the weekend stuff to do, and I figured might as well do it today. So I've got 14 things going out on eBay, um, three Etsy orders. So if someone just snuck in a couple of ones while the... Um, the sale was still on. Let me just double check. I think. Yeah, the sale on my shop is finished now. Boo. You can still use the code treat yourself though to get 10% off. Um, oh, there's lots of things in people's baskets. Like, oh, they should have checked out before midnight. Oh, well. But yeah, you can still use the 10% code treat yourself and you know, treat yourself to something in the new year. Um, I know for the next few weeks, though, things are going to be, uh, you know, a bit tight for people. And then, is it normally around like the 26th or something you have, like Blue Monday? So it's like, that's something to look forward to, isn't it? Anyways, I'm going to uh, watch some more of the live action Lion King. I'm going to get my orders together and um, show you what's going out. Okay, this is what's going out. The hangover is a coming, I can feel it. Okay, so we've got um, Marks and Spencer's triangle collar necklace, new with tags, which originally £7.50 in Marks and Spencer's. Sorry, £17.50. Um, I saw that £5.99. A little basket brooch with these really nice blue flowers. That's sold for £7.99. A pair of my old roller boots. Moxie roller boots. Um, when I had the silly idea that we were going to learn and stuff and then just went, oh dear, broke my toe and uh, didn't do it again. So, um, but they sold for £60. Hopefully they'll get some use out of them. This vintage American History Society pocket watch with a little coin in it. That's sold for £12. This lovely um, Austrian, Bohemian or Czech, probably Austrian glass. Uh, pendant $7.99, a two kilogram job lot of costume jewellery $19.99, this The Saint pendant $11.99, this little faux pill um, tie clip slide thing, it kind of sits there like over the tie, uh, that's gone for $6.99, two job lots of brooches, uh, that would have been on my store for quite a while, so £15.50 for those. This faceted glass ball, uh, little dangly earring, $7.99. A wooden squirrel, uh, brooch, $4.99. Um, $11.99 for this job lot of Marks and Spencer's bits. Um, £4.50 for this little articulated enamel fish. A job lot of broken brooches, $9.99. Mother of Pearl inlay earrings, five pounds. I think they're our pack of Mexico, those ones. And this little Bohemian glass filigree brooch, seven pounds 19. And then over on Etsy, this lovely moonstone and topaz necklace. And this butterfly wing, it's like a little kingfisher on there, little bird. 
beautiful one. And then going to Marion. Hello, Marion. I'm sorry to do damage to your wallet. <laughs> um, it says I'm not good for a bank account. I'm sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Anyway, these are winging this way to you. Lovely Macintosh style amber earrings. And then this like pearl and I'm not quite sure what just glittery pink pendant. Um, so they're going to be going out. I say today, tomorrow, but you know what I mean. Right, I'm going to pack these up and hopefully be done before my hangover kicks in. I'm also waiting for someone to come round and help me move the chest of drawers I'm getting rid of from upstairs. You know, that um, the one that I had all my makeup and stuff on because uh, I put it on Facebook Marketplace and um, someone's going to give me 20 quid for it. You know, I think that's what I paid for it ages and ages ago. I could probably have gotten more for it if I'd hold out, but do you know what? They can have it for 20 quid. They're taking it away, but we do have to move it down the stairs, like me and the person that's coming around. So, uh, I'm not looking forward to that. I don't want to move furniture with a hangover, but here we are. Anyways, catch you in a bit. Some other stuff going out today. So, um, Nat sent me a picture of her Dashen, so she gets the cool Dashen earrings. So they will be going off to you shortly. Um, a copy of Mum's book is going off to Jen. And then I managed to, I emailed a company in London, a charity in London, um, that I was like, oh, do you accept and distribute, um, you know, like the, the, waist cinches and things like that the um you know control underwear that i had from after my operations um you know to reduce the swelling and things like that i was like are they of any use to you and they were like yes if you could um like that would be brilliant if you could send them to this address thank you very much so that is the place that i am sending them to so i've got like five things in there there's like one kind of whole body one one boobs and down one, one that uh, just, whoosh, whoosh. Um, oh, another boobs and down one, but that one's got a crotch on it, and there's something else, probably a very similar one. Oh, one that's just, just uh, another one of them, but you have to do it all up, not Velcro. So anyway, five things going to them, I hope they can be on use, so that's cool. Um, and yeah, pretty much done on my post. I'm pretty much caught up now. Um, annoyingly, because it's a bank holiday, there's um, uh, like, there's like no money in my business account because uh, no money goes in today. So that's a little bit like, uh, you know, because I've got all of them and all the money is in eBay account. Um, Etsy is transferring them, but I'm not sure if that'll be in today. That'll probably be in tomorrow as well. So... They're all ready to go, I just can't print labels. Oh well, never mind. Um, I think I might be managing to avoid the hangover. It is like half past 12 and it, like, even though I've got like fuzzy brain, it's not coming full on. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. But I really wish that that bloke would text and say when he's coming around to um, pick up the unit because I would really like it kind of gone now, you know, get that done. Oh well. Oh, so I brought the drawers down from uh, from the unit, but stopping for some lunch. We've got some leftovers from yesterday and some eggs, leftover cheese, leftover bacon, everything leftover. <sighs> Whew. Well, that's done. Moving furniture in the rain, lovely. But um, it's gone to a nice guy actually. He runs a vintage business in Swansea, and um, his missus does upcycling of things. Um, so it might get upcycled or he might just sell it on as it is, um, but pretty cool, he's a nice chap. And he said like, oh, uh, they did do vintage jewellery, they've got some left, he's going to send me photos, see if I want them. So that's quite cool, yay. Awesome stuff. Um, I did say goodbye to my mannequin Liberty Bell as well. Um, he says he has a bunch of like 60s mannequins that um like in his sort of warehousey type thing i guess or show house um and that she'd fit well in there um 
because I was like, I'm not doing anything with her. She's taking up space that I kind of need. And she's sort of being wasted, just sat in the corner with a hat on her head. And that was it. Um, so hopefully you can do something with her, maybe restore her because she was like chipping paint and things like that. But um, yeah, he was like, oh, she's brilliant. Thank you. So gone to a good home, I think. Or, you know, at least someone that knows what to do with her and things rather than her just stood there. But I'm chuffed. I'm chuffed that there's gone to someone cool that, that appreciates and knows their stuff. So I am happy. <sighs> right, I can relax a bit now um, because my work for today is done. I know that wasn't work, but I wasn't looking forward to moving furniture. It's a bit of a potch, isn't it? But it's done. I've got a little bit of cash for him. So, happy times. Oof, you can't see it, but this is dinner tonight. Sausage, mash, gravy, broccoli. Kind of like a last supper thing before um, cutting out the carbs again, because my God, do I feel like stodge. Oh, well that was lush and I'm feeling sleepy now. I, I definitely need some sleep. So um, I'm gonna go to bed now. I shall probably see you in a few days, but for the next couple of days, you've got some sparkly things to look forward to. Bye-bye now, bye-bye.